Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, quick news update for you for the JP side of Dokkan Battle. The Harutagon Dokkan event story um, has been officially announced, or event end story has been officially announced. Um, let's see, we have in the campaign overview, I'm actually checking the news right now, it, do, it does have it up in the news on JP side. So you can go inside and see it there if you would like to. We have the Dokkan event with a banner, and I mean, we're not, we don't really actually have the exclusive who's going to be on the banner. We do see this epic, epic image over here, which is going to be the thumbnail for my video. <laughs> I really like that's freaking nuts. I love it. And then we have also this. So this is going to be the story event and the banner that's going to be coming. The banner is, the text says, sealed inside of me, there is a phantom demon. A thousand years have passed and the phantom demon will resurrect defeat the strong enemy that is on the path to destruction. Then we have the story event with the banner there that I had already showed you. The story is, Goku and company have met a mysterious, or mysterious elderly man, Hoi, who tells them the legendary hero and the evil that is approaching Earth. The hero Tapion has been revived with the power of the Dragon Balls, but he disappeared with many questions unanswered. That night, a huge monster appears and <clears throat> goes on a rampage and starts destroying the city. You will be able to obtain a couple of characters from the event, including Trunks' kit. You will you will also be able to get items, or get an item that will be useful in Dokkan events. So I don't know if that's supposed to be multiple items or one item. There's a little bit of a grammar typo there. <laughs> <clears throat> Dates are Dokkan event and story event will start on the 19th JST. That's 1700. It is currently 12:30 a.m. JST. So we have 16 and a half hours from the time of recording this. It is 10 a.m. Eastern Time, so 17 hours from now. I didn't do the math, so figure that one out. <laughs> uh, but we have seven, essentially less than 24 hours. So by tomorrow morning, for, you, for those of us on the East Coast, by tomorrow morning, it will be live. So that's going to be awesome. Um, the Battle of God story event is live on the global side. I figure I'd mention that. <clears throat> and let's see, the JP official information from the Reddit is missions to be added to challenge best time of Dokkan Speed Battle winner of Jump Fiesta. So uh, when, we have, when I have more information about that, I will definitely give it to you. Missions will be added where you can challenge the winning time of the Dokkan Speed Battle event at Jump Fest 18, which is really cool. There will be some adjustments made to the existing Boss Rush stages. Because of these changes, both Speed Battle and Boss Rush will not be playable during December 19th, 10 a.m. to 17 p.m. at JST. So the same dates of tomorrow, today, tomorrow, we will not be able to play those two things. So they are going to make an incentive to try and beat the best player's time. So all that's going to be there. This is a little image that they did for it. So that's really awesome. Uh, all this is happening within the next 24 hours, guys. So once it comes released, I will definitely let you know. But uh, anyway, guys, thank you. I will probably be doing a live. I may be doing a live stream tonight. I don't know yet. I'll probably be doing a live stream tonight. So if you want to jump on, I'll probably be on around 11, 11.30 p.m. Eastern time if you want to hang out. But anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. Make sure to subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you all later. Peace.